Hello, teacher. I can hear you. Sorry, my microphone was off. <laughs> uh -huh. So good evening, guys. Uh, great to uh -huh. have you today. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. How good. are you? I guess I'm doing fine as well. So everything's good and the week is almost over. So that has to be good news, definitely. So thank you guys for joining. Uh, well, I already heard Mauricio and Rafael. I saw Yolanda super early. <laughs> so hi, Yolanda, good evening. Great to have you. As I said, good evening. Thank hi, you teacher. for joining. Daniel, hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? Monica, great to see you. I hope you I can. I I'm forgot fine. to do the homework, teacher. teacher. Actually, I was I was going to remind you. I was going to write uh, like a couple of minutes ago, like, hey, do your homework. But I was like, mm, I don't think. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, you. but I do. I, okay. I didn't. I don't like that the, the trivia. I don't. I don't know. <laughs> oh, don't worry. We are going to try to do it together. No okay. worries. Uh, Irving, good evening. And uh, yeah, I think we are good. How was your day, guys? Did you have a good day? Yes, I have a good day. Yeah. Ah, yes, very nice. We always, Finally. We always have a good day. <laughs> Some days are better than others, but I'm glad. I'm really glad to hear uh, that. All days are good. Or, we all days are good. Yeah, we have a... If we have a life, we have we have a good day. Oh, definitely. Yeah. We gotta be thankful. When we However, close the eyes, when we close the eyes, that's the finish. <laughs> oh, that, that's a good that's a good way to see that. All right. Well, for example, the day that I don't have time to do exercise, so I'm 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 at my lowest, you know. So I'm like everything is I look at everything like in a in a in a dark way. <laughs> No, but but yeah, so that is a definitely a really good way to see that. What about the rest of you? Claudia, good evening. How are you doing? Good evening, everybody. Hello, uh, Chris. Yeah, yeah, good evening. I read your message, Chris. Yeah, I good couldn't evening, reply back, but I, I read it. Thank you. Fernando, good evening. Thanks a lot for joining. I'm super happy to see you guys. I know we do have a trivia pending, but we are going to do that later on did you do it did you write a couple of ideas a couple of sentences yes, yes i see you like that ready amazing yes, we have it. finally yes teacher. good <laughs> and i i, I start the plat platform too <laughs> oh very good nice it's not a lot there are not too many exercises actually so it is not that much rafael did you do your homework no i didn't oh okay okay what about the rest of you guys did you do it i do just you have some questions? you have some questions uh the trivia yes 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 i did some some <laughs> that's okay but... that's okay yeah i mean the point is just pretty much uh, to get used to like using the password boys to get familiar with it little by little it is going to be part of our vocabulary we are going to get more comfortable but pretty much that was the idea so we are going to do it like by the end of the class because we have something else at the beginning that we are going to be working on today we are going to check a little bit of past i know you handle this i know you really manage the topic but it is more um, related to storytelling and connecting ideas so we are going to be uh, trying to tell stories are you good at storytelling guys do you like telling stories do you have a lot of stories to tell <laughs> now okay do you like do you like watching movies for example or watching series or soap operas serious it depends on kind of soap operas even <laughs> Rosa de Guadalupe counts no. <laughs> <laughs> not that word the Outlander, new... maybe. <laughs> Outlander. Oh, okay. The new Pasión de Gavilanes. Have you seen it? You're not into that drama, like Mexican soap opera thing. No. The rich people. Uh, I don't know. Uh, también lloran. Are crying too. <laughs> ah, is that a soap opera? Oh. Yes, but long time ago, it's a Mexican oh. soap opera. <laughs> ah, okay. More than thir thirty years. <laughs> 
Uh, okay, I have never heard that one. You are a baby mm. teacher. Um, I look. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> but but I love soap operas, so I have seen like a lot of soap operas. I'm I'm gonna search for that tonight. Yeah. Well, there are some that are pretty old, you know. So that is pretty much what we are gonna be doing. Uh, whenever we try to tell what happened to other people we tend to come to storytelling. So we are going to just review some verbs before we get into storytelling. Um, in general, guys, if you, for example, if you watch a, a movie, if you watch series, what is your favorite genre? Are you more into action? Are you into historic things? Are you into sci-fi? So what, what is your favorite genre? Or do you prefer prefer the series in which people are crying all the time? So like drama, romance, and all of, and tear jerkers. What do you prefer? What's your I favorite? The dramas. For example, what's your favorite? Korean dramas. Oh, Korean. Okay. Yeah. So Korean, Japanese, Chinese, Taiwanese, all of them? Hindi. Yes, I, Korean. Hindu? Yes, Korean. Hindi. Oh. Are we talking about Bollywood? Like Bollywood movies? No, for example, we have a... Yes, the, Bollywood the, movies. I think it's soap opera, like uh, Reina del Sur. Oh, but we are talking about that's levels a good, here. That's a good... That's uh, a really movies. good one. Like, like drug dealers, right? <laughs> Okay. Uh, I don't know with, if that is with action. Opera. With action, I don't like that. The the because the the usually all the soap opera Mexican soap opera all all the time all the time are crying. I are agree. crying and crying. No, oh, come on. Uh, it is so upsetting. I have to say because it's like I like to see empowered women in soap opera. So La Reina del Sur for me was like she is so good. <laughs> so she was so empowered. So I totally agree with you. I liked it a lot, guys. What about the rest of you? Have you ever seen those soap operas like Reina del Sur? You know, um, Korean, the one that Krisha mentioned. Are you into those? Do you watch them, or what do you watch? No, in my case, I prefer uh, action movies. Okay, just action? Uh, For example? Action and, and comedia, some comedias. Oh, so you like comedy? Uh, comedy, yeah. Uh, who? Comedy who are we talking about? Like Jim uh, Carrey? Not really. Uh, uh -huh. I prefer the Adam Sandler movies. Oh, okay. In my case, uh, I think that uh, he's, he's very funny as a person and he he think as the people is watching him. Oh, oh, all right. I always confuse these two actors, Adam Sandler and the other guy that appears in Noah, the Ark of Noah, something like that. I don't remember his name, uh, but it's all there. I, for, I forgot the name, but... Yes. But but he's into comedy too. Uh -huh. so yeah, I always yeah. confuse them. I don't know why. But yeah, so I have seen only those two actors in comedy. Yeah, uh, I know they are talking about, but I forgot. Yeah, I, I forgot in the name as well. Yeah. Uh, I'm not much into comedy because I don't understand. <laughs> so I have to be honest. I watch something and I start asking like my brother, what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Explain that back to me. So what about the rest of you guys? Rafael, you look very serious all the time. What is your favorite type of uh, like uh, genre of movies or series? I'm sorry, I, I have work in this moment, but... Oh, no, no, no. I mean, you look like I'm... a serious person. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I'm already so finished. Not... Oh, okay, okay. So, um, what do you prefer? What type of movies are you into? I prefer uh, romantic. Oh, and, okay. And, um, the ones that make you cry? Like drama? No, no. Titanic? <laughs> no. No, so when you say um, romantic, what do you mean? Um, history about romantic. 
I don't know in that in this moment, but uh, the notebook. Yes, the notebook. You before me. Those are the only right. ones I know. Right. Oh, oh, yes. so that's truly really, okay. So true romance. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Very interesting. That sounds and, good. Okay. And comedia, comedic. Comedy. So you like comedy, comedy. as well. Yes. Okay. Yes. Ben Stiller. Ben is, oh, Ben Stiller is the other guy that confused. Yes, that's exactly the one. All yeah, right. So similar. comedy and romance, action. Okay. What about the rest of you guys? What are you into? Dago, hi Dagoberto, Carla, Safi. What about you guys? Irving, what do you prefer? I agree with I, um, I prefer real life based pictures. Oh, okay. Like this, what, for example, I'm not like. Uh, for example, uh, uh, the Second World War, it could be based oh. movies or okay. uh, real histories. Okay. So real, okay. So realism, but but movies, right? Or serious? I don't know if that is movies. a serious. Okay, yeah. very interesting. That's it. So just real life stories. Oh, okay, okay. So uh, I'm more into, you know, uh, for some reason, I cannot watch romance. So um, probably the two genres that I'm not into are romance. And uh, yeah, that would be it. So I cannot watch, for example, Titanic because I fall asleep. <laughs> and, and, and I don't like the kind of movies where you start like crying and crying. So I'm like, um, no, that's not for me. Or a horror because I feel something is going to come up at night and it's going to pull me or drag me. So I'm like, no. Are you into horror, guys? What, what do you think about these uh, horror, horror stories, is, horror movies? Uh -huh. uh, horror is funny to me. No. <laughs> the way fun? that they, they, the way that the characters are killed is so stupid, to be honest. <laughs> oh, OK. Oh, because you, OK. I enjoy but, this kind of, of no, movies, horror movies. Seriously? But yes, I always uh, uh, saw this kind of, uh, watch this kind of movies with my husband, but yeah. always he's, uh, he was asleep. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and okay. for me it's a problem because I so afraid and he is uh, <laughs> and, and he's away <laughs> yes <laughs> okay so he's off oh, that's a good point okay guys what about the rest of you elvis carlos what do you prefer are you into horror uh, are you into romance good evening teacher Hi. i prefer um the movie action action okay yeah. um, what's your yeah. favorite is um action um they, um, uh, no, no prefer uh, this is uh, all, all option. Okay. No prefer it. Oh, okay, okay. No worries, uh, Noemi, thank you. I was actually going to ask you that. I <laughs> okay, oh, okay. So you don't have a favorite one? So just in general, all that genre, okay? Yeah, uh, yeah, yes, got it. Vero, Elvis, what about you guys? Silvia, do you have any favorite? Dago, I'm sorry, Dago, um, I couldn't hear you before. I, I, I like uh, almost all genres. Uh, oh. I, I enjoy any movie. Uh, only oh. the movie that uh, uh, that uh, killer I don't like. Killer? Uh, uh, what do you mean? I, I kill, 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 kill. <laughs> for, example, like, uh, for example, for example, eh, como digo, Massacre in Texas. Ah, Texas oh, Massacre or Chainsaw yeah. Massacre, something like that. Oh, Friday 13. Friday 13. Like. Okay. What Halloween, about, I don't like him. Uh, yeah, actually, there are two characters one that appears like with a mask. Freddy, exactly. I think, right? Ah, Freddy is his name. But Fre Freddy is. is it's good. It, okay. It, it have an, okay. It have an interesting, interesting uh, history. 
Oh, okay. I don't know. Was it for real? I have never seen them, so I'm not that familiar. Is Freddy or the other? Is Freddy a person? Jason. 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 Oh, J uh, Jason? Jason uh -huh. is in, in... In your dreams or in your nightmares, right? Friday the 13th. Uh, Friday the 13th. Oh, okay. So you're going to tell me a little bit about that in a second. Now, guys, I have actually like a little story for you. Uh, sorry, Mauricio. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, it's all right. Um, so sorry. I thought you were telling us. I have a story. Um, it is just a piece of a story, but it is kind of taken from a horror movie. I don't know if you are into this, but I need your help to complete this short description. Okay. So this is like chapter number one. And we are going to use simple present and we are going to use simple past to try to complete this story okay so who wants to begin guys who wants to help us to complete the first chapter me okay please uh, oh, oh, but a uh, line or old chapter no 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 i think we can stop in the in the period okay. we can stop in uh, the period do you believe in ghost mm -hmm. ghost uh, lives live everywhere and they uh, are invisible. Okay, well, thank you. Oh, yeah, please continue until the next period. Okay, well, let me tell you what happened to me, what happened to me last year. All right, thank you so much. Let me just stop there. Guys, I uh, got a question for you. Do you believe in ghosts? No. No? Yes. <laughs> no, I don't believe in ghosts. No. no, no, you don't. No, no. nobody does. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, so I guess then you are not afraid of them. You're not afraid of these supernatural things. No. Good uh, to know. In my case, I have never seen uh, any ghosts. I have never seen anything. I never seen it. <laughs> if 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 I, in a time I so I see a ghost. Probably I, I will believe in that, but that will time, change. No, <laughs> okay. In my mind, but not really. But oh, now. okay, okay. I have never seen anything, but whenever I listen to a, a sound at night, you know, or any noise, so I'm like, okay, maybe the ghost is coming for me. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Are the cats, uh, <laughs> cats or mouse? We hear that yeah, are cats. Are cats in, in, in my house, live Toshio. Toshio, what's that? Don't, don't you know? No, what's uh, that? Don't you, Tell don't us. Don't you see La Maldición, una película japonesa? Nope. Uh, but no. you will tell us about it. I think it's coming really interesting here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Monica? I saw that movie and actually are a parody Gosh. comedy about this movie. Oh, oh, there is a parody about that one? Okay. Yeah, it's very famous. Actually, when we are talking about ghosts, recently I live uh, a paranormal, I don't know who say. Experience. Experience, oh. yeah. Actually it was Monday and this week. Are you serious? What happened? I was with my husband and my baby in the bed was maybe very close to be the 3 p.m., 3 a.m. Okay. So I remember that I was, trying that my baby go to sleep you know get to sleep mm -hmm. and we are like we don't have the the light of the bedroom you know on uh-huh we we no 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 we have off like it's very very dark okay at night or our bedroom so i saw a woman in the in the bed the side of oh. my, my husband asleep yeah was yeah. so yeah, I was so scared because I believe in God, I believe in a paranormal thing, but I have something I respect, you know. Yeah, I respect, but also I don't gonna you know involve involve me. Involve, you're not going involve. to get involved. Right? I mean that thing, but yeah, I live that. I actually I feel right now like very not scared, but nervous. But, 
nervous at night uh -huh. yeah because oh. i've been living in this house around two years so i never live something like that so this is my first experience and it's very like i don't know for me who can explain because my husband has have a the tournament at night he worked uh like two weeks to do it like continue at night so i be my baby oh, and I you're and alone. Alone. yeah oh. we are alone. i feel like oh my god so you feel a little <laughs> nervous you know so i i believe that sometimes uh your brain our brain yeah. can deceive us right do you know the meaning of deceive no uh, i write it in the chat so deceive mm, have you seen this before no no Okay, so deceive is like traicionar or engañar. So I think that sometimes also our brain can deceive us, you know, can play like a joke on us. Let's hope, <laughs> let's really hope that that is what happened to you. But it comes really interesting. Wow, as I didn't expect to, to hear, like so you had an encounter. If you see another woman in your, in your bed with your husband, are you sure that no. are you jealous? No. <laughs> what? Oh, okay. I, I, I will get myself on right? I will get myself on the recording. <laughs> okay. Wow. So you're going to tell us about that. Okay, guys, let's move on here. So um, we were in the part like the person was going to explain or was going to tell what happened. So guys, repeat with me. Happened. 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 Scared, maybe it was my dog Morty making the noise. Thank you. Let me just stop you right there. Thank you so much for that. Let's take a look at this. I love this expression. I slept soundly. So when you are sleeping, but you are sleeping so deeply, right? We use the word soundly. In my case, for example, I sleep soundly. So I go to bed, I fall asleep, and nothing wakes me up until next day, like around five or something. So that is a sleep soundly. Guys, do you sleep soundly? No. Sound, soundly? Soundly, uh -huh, like deeply. Soundly. 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 Do you sleep soundly? Mm -hmm. Or do you soundly. have a light? Or the opposite is light sleep. Do you have a light sleep? Yes, I have a light sleep. Yeah. So have you a have a light sleep. sleep. Okay. So there is an earthquake and you wake up or there is a sound and you wake up or do you sleep soundly? Light, in my case it's light. Light, okay, so it is light. All right, so the person says, I sleep soundly in my warm, cozy bed. And I like this one and all of a sudden, so you're sleeping and like this, right? All of a sudden, I hear a strange sound. So it's like, okay, this got to be really crazy. Um, so let's continue here. Sylvia, please, can you help me after maybe? Oh, sorry, no, it was, but no, right here in the, at the bottom. But no, Mori, um, light right outside my bedroom door on his favorite rug. Continue. Yes, please. He... He is not it. Even oh no, he was whatever. It's not. So he was even. But there are two space. Oh yes, um, one is for was. So he was um, uh huh even, and we are going okay. to include nor. It's nor. He was even. Snoring, mm -hmm. but I uh, snoring loudly. Mm -hmm. Someone knocked it on the front door. 
Thank you so much. There we go. Okay, so let's take a look at this. Uh, the person said all of a sudden, right? Immediately. So out of the thing air, something uh, happened. There was a strange noise. And the person said, oh, my dog. But the dog was right there, right? Um, and it says he was even snoring. Do you know the meaning of a snore? Are you familiar with the word snore? No, I don't know. Yeah. Yes. I was desire. Um, close. When you're sleeping and you're super, super tired, you make some noises with your throat. Do you snore when you are sleeping? Yes. Like on uh -huh. Yes. Do you snore? Yes. I snore, but when I'm extremely, extremely tired, otherwise, no. Do you snore? No. You snore with the nose? Uh -huh. Or like, but loudly? <laughs> Okay, so you snored loudly. My, my husband snored very. My husband is now. Okay. He snores loudly. Okay. Loudly. Okay. When you, when you sleep with the with the open mouth. Mm -hmm. I I heard snore. that. Uh -huh. I heard that you have to like move somebody's neck. I don't know if that works, but I saw it on, in YouTube. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So that is a snore. When someone knocked. All right. Uh, on the front door. Guys, repeat with me. Not. 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 So let's, re let's repeat this one. Happened. 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 Not. 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 Okay. There we go. Very uh, so nice. Yes. Sorry, teacher. Yes. And the last one, and the last one, you you tape uh knocked, but is not correct. Someone was knocking on the front door. Mm -mm, let me see. He was even snoring loudly. Someone knocked on the front door. Um, no, I think okay. it depends because knocked, I would understand just like this, you know. And was knocking, I would understand like this. I guess it really depends. So for context, let me just make sure. Let me just check, double check the answer. Mm, no, yeah, that, that is not. Mm -hmm. But okay. however, okay. someone was knocking on the front door, that would make sense as well. So that would be all right as well. Okay, guys. Thanks. You're so welcome. So this is the first uh, part of the story. Definitely we have here like a lot that we can imply, but we are going to practice uh, telling the stories today. So the next exercise is just a review of the most common words that we can get. And we are going to do this orally, especially with the regular verbs that I know can tend to be a little complicated to pronounce. So, um, if you remember regular verbs, I just need to add ed, right, for past. But irregular verbs that are the ones that you have in light blue, they are the ones that change, present, past, and past participle. Guys, uh, can you please help me with the past of B? Orally, you don't need to write anything. Can you tell me the past of B? Was. Was. Was where. Okay, was and where. So become. Became. 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 Begin. Begin. Uh, Bye. Yes. Choose. Choose. Chosen. Chosen. Mm, the other one. Chose. chose. Uh -huh, yeah. Chose. Chosen would be the past participle, but it's correct. A come. Came. 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 Forget. Forgot. 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 Go. Went. 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 Grow. Went. Group. Group. Um, the other one, group, group, perfect. Uh, have, uh, have, 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 lose, lose, lose. lose. very nice. Uh, read, read. Red. Red. exactly, read, sell, sell, sell. sell. spend, spend. 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 and the last one is take. Cook. 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 Exactly. Cook. Now, let's go with the regular verbs. These are easier because you just include D, but the pronunciation can tend to be a little tricky sometimes, right? So let's do it together. Decide, decided. So repeat with me. Decided. 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 Decided.
Designed. 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 Okay. Destroyed. 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 Finished. 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 Let's include a T. Finished. 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 Exactly. Invited. Invited. Lived. Lived. Looked. Looked. And a T. Looked. Look, 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 look. Painter. Painter. Played. 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 Okay. Preferred. Preferred. Okay. Rained. Rained. Repaired. Repaired. Survived. Survive. Word. 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 And the T. <laughs> Word. 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 So we have I work like I work every day and I worked yesterday. So we need it. I worked oh. yesterday. Mm -hmm. That is the difference, right? Okay, guys. Now that we got this, let's get it started and we are going to do the next one. We have a little bit of a storytelling here. We have some pictures, okay, that we are going to use for this activity. We are going to try to make a story in groups. You decide the order, but you decide if this is a romance, uh, like a romantic story, if this is horror story, adventurous story, and you, of course, decide the order, but you need to include all of them, okay? We are going to include a couple of expressions and I'm going to write them in the chat. For example, all of a sudden. Um, so all of a sudden, right? When I am not expecting anything, so all of a sudden. I'm going to use, for example, some expressions like sudden, suddenly. S suddenly. So we are gonna use suddenly, all of a sudden, all right? We are going to use other expressions like, for example, soundly like what we were saying i was sleeping soundly for example so soundly is like deeply right other expressions that we we are going to be using is once once is like when you are telling a story you say one time once upon a time once upon a time exactly mm -hmm. so una vez, and then you start like talking about it so we are going to try to incorporate those little um, expressions into your story. And of course, everything gotta be simple, fast. So uh, give me one second. I'm going to make the groups. You don't need to write it, guys. Try not to write it. Of course, you can look for new words, new vocabulary, but try not to write it. Try to just uh, speak about it. Try to put it together as a group, right? Not individually. Um, I'm sending you there. I'm going to give you like 10 minutes, 10, 12 minutes to uh, create the story. Okay, and then we are going to have some volunteers and tell us the story. You decide if this is romance, horror, adventure, etc. So enjoy you guys. You can go there. Go, 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 go.
his her computer. Sorry. Turn or turn on the computer and turn on the And in that moment, an idea uh, appeared. <laughs> okay, so turn on the computer. Mm -hmm. Near the kitchen, near the kitchen for. Ah, okay, near the kitchen. Near the kitchen. And um, how do you say chile verde or pimiento? Uh, chile, I don't remember. Bell pepper. pepper. Red pepper. Green no? pepper. Red and green pepper. <laughs> but this is red pepper, right? Yes. Okay, near the kitchen, what happened with the pepper? Uh, uh -huh. uh, Near the kitchen, what? Uh, turn on the computer and one. Uh, near the kitchen, she took uh, he, her knife and cut the red pepper, no? <laughs> but who? Sorry? Could here, Monica? That too much money. <laughs> Every month. No, we, but, come on. <laughs> we but, don't celebrate every month. No, 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 but it's only when you. Maybe they send uh, some uh, some letters to each other every month. Uh, <laughs> Not the big That's deal, the most common. Right. Send a call. Send a call. Hey, hello. How are you? Uh, a WhatsApp message. Uh -huh. yeah. It's something like. We have six months together, and I and I be, want to give some give you something special and like I don't know a chocolate like a but bracelet. It's, it's, it's normal to be only in the first twelve months. That if you you know have more than one year, is it's normal that you're going to celebrate the anniversary, you know. But when you are starting the relationship, it's very com common give. I give every month, but only in the beginning, you know, in the in the first year. Yeah. Okay, we have so you. Your, so your husband gave you a gift every month in the first, the first year? <laughs> the first, yeah, I could say that, yeah, because for me, it's, but, it's the food, my, my, my gift. Done some no. Yeah. So uh, he's very romantic. <laughs> we lose the co the communication with Monica. Monica. Uh -huh. Right. We have just used jewelry. We have uh, left television, her green pepper paints and bird. Who wants to try to be? the second line or to create the second line. A one in specific. Yes. Ah, okay. But he sent to everyone. To everybody, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you, you can Don't worry, continue. don't worry. You can continue. Uh, okay. Written, yeah, whatever. This is a all comedy. Of them, all of them can read it. And it's our idea. Yes. This is a comedy story. Yes. Yes, it's comedy. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. okay. Let me see. Oh, what's up on a time, a beautiful and funny bird uh, was flying, bringing uh, flying around the, the window, maybe around, around the window. Uh, 
Um, okay. Uh, hi the guys. Window, um, Brian. Claudia, I don't know if you're typing. Are you typing in the computer? <laughs> Sorry. Uh, are you typing? Are you typing in the computer? It's only for yeah. uh, we have a, a lot of uh, ideas. Idea. Uh, because yeah. if you are typing, you can share your screen, so everybody has visibility. Oh. And, and I think it's easier, uh -huh, so they know exactly where you are going. Mm -hmm. So okay. um, share a screen is in the middle is the, the the green button. Let me see. I have a lot of uh, documents because oh. I try to <laughs> yeah, I try to help to uh, with a uh, homework to my daughter. Oh, see. I see. Yeah. Okay. It's a share screen. Okay. Uh, what option is screen share okay yeah you share screen oh okay you can see that mm -hmm. yeah much better so everybody has visibility okay the the words is computer uh, paper yeah paper yeah beard Thanks. Okay. something Teacher, that the imagine is a wig or is a woman? Uh, hi, that's a wig. Yeah. Wig. So we can use a ghost with a wig who, who likes the wig. And the ghost, um, volaba. Fly the ghost um, in pass. What is flying pass? Flow. No. <laughs> Guys. No, I'm. I'm... Uh, so that is flu. So flu, flu. Mm -hmm. The ghost flew to the store because the ghost like the jewelry too. Um. Suddenly, the ghost uh flew uh. A nice bear, a little bear, and the bear uh, was picoteando or eating a pimentón in another store. But, but. In, Another idea. And um, a ghost uh -huh. who wanted to wear a, a wig and dreaming of putting on my cap. <laughs> but, but, but here, not here, there are, uh, there is not makeup, it's like a paint. Or using makeup or like makeup. My idea is like makeup. That I I saw I, I see uh, paints like the people used to to paint uh, quadros. Ah. Oh. For pictures. Yeah, I don't see makeup. I don't see like makeup. I see um, paints. Paints or pictures? No, pen, paints. Paints that.
Hello guys and welcome back. Let's just wait some minutes for the rest of the guys uh, to join us. I guess they are still practicing. So how was your practice? Were you able to get in agreement? Were you able to, to um, I don't know, agree on the type of story you were telling? Was it difficult to tell the story? What, what do you think? What was the, the difficult part? Like to put the story together or to get in agreement? Um, to make this story with all the pictures. The <laughs> okay, so the challenge was to include all the pictures, okay? Okay, yeah. Nice, because it pushes vocabulary. So we have yes. to find a way to, to put the vocabulary together. Yeah. Okay, amazing. Guys, what type of stories do we have? Do we have, um, I don't know, a comedy here? Do we have romance? Do we have action? What do we have? It's a mix. Comedy. A mix. Horror, <laughs> horror and comedy. Com okay, horror, comedy, a mixture. What else? Okay, I guess. I don't know, fantastic no, story. No, okay, fantasy. a little bit of fantasy, adventure. I don't know. Okay. War. So, War. Okay. What? <laughs> okay. So I definitely want to listen to your stories. So let's go. Let's go. I have four groups. So guys, I don't know if I have any volunteer from each group or do okay. we select victims? Our team. Okay. Perfect. So you want to volunteer? Yeah. Go oh, for it. Amazing. Go for it. <laughs> okay. So. Uh, uh -uh. Okay, this, uh, our story is the next one. So, once upon a time, in the forest, a woman was alone at home. The night was so dark. Suddenly, she listened a stranger beer whispered. While the woman turned around the computer, near the kitchen, some person was calling the red pepper. She was scared when she listened the knife. She went to the kitchen and she looked around and found a shadow. In this moment, she looking for her paints and draw the ghost. The jewelry was stolen by the ghost. The end. <laughs> hey, that was super nice. Kudos for you. I love the, wow, you have very nice storytelling skills. Like you put like a lot of emotion into it. So even I could imagine the woman like looking at the bird, turning around <laughs> and looking for the brushes to paint. Yeah. That was cool. Yeah. This that was is really a funny nice to yeah. work with them. It was funny. <laughs> Definitely, I bet. Congrats. Wow, that was a very nice one. A very nice way of combining like the emotion. So I, I will I'll give a word to the Hollywood. But only for washing the cars. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but it's an ability because I can try to tell you a story, but I lack the fun aspect of it, you know? So, yeah, it's really cool. Amazing. Thank you, guys. Guys, uh, I have four groups. I'm missing three. Who's next? Who wants to give it a try? Group two? I have Sophie, I have Susanna, Irving, Mau, and Monica. Volunteers. Or shall we go for victims? <laughs> da, 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 da. No volunteers? Ma Mauricio, tell me one number from one to five, please. Two. Don't say nothing, Mauricio. Two. Number two is uh, Susanna. <laughs> Thank you, Susanna. Oh, so on. you are the lucky one. <laughs> okay. So, um, I, I try to. Sure, to, let's give it a try. To do it, okay. Um, one day, um, I was studying at my room when all of a sudden I um, heard a noise, uh, a, a very uh, high noise. Mm -hmm. and, and I think. I thought, um, I forgot to turn off my computer, 
but um, I check the computer and and also and and I um, and I realized that the computer uh, wasn't uh, turn turn off. It was uh, encendido. On. It was on. It was on. And I can see, um, I can see uh, a bear and a, a video of a bear. Okay. And, and then I come back to, to my room. Um, only that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Nice. Very nice I, drive. I don't know how to include um, other features, and because uh, I don't know if they are earrings, earrings, and, and uh, uh, that would be jewelry. Yeah. So that's jewelry oh. in general. I know, and okay. I totally get it. But you did a very nice, <laughs> uh, a very nice attempt. So that was really cool. All right. Okay. Thank you for that. Uh, group thank number you. three. Do we have any volunteer from group number three? So I'm missing Dago, Noemi, uh, Silvia, and Vera. Volunteers? Or group number four. So I'm missing Carlos, Claudia, Daniel, and Rafael. I, I can read that the group three teacher. Sure, please go ahead, Sylvia. Tell us the story. Okay. Once upon a time, there's a golf bikes the wigs. And she take the she take the wig and take a selfie and upload for the computer to share on Facebook. <laughs> the ghost was blue to the jewelry store because the ghost likes so much the jewelry. Mm -hmm. In that moment, in another store, so a beautiful and little bear eating from the red pimenton. Okay. And the ghost told that she want to look, to look her in a mirror and decide to paint of color yellow, red, blue, and sky and brown her body. She painted the, her arms, her legs and her face. Then she was boring and come back at the world ghost. Oh, okay. And that was the end of the of the story. Yeah. Oh, okay. So that sounds like one of the one of the ghosts in Casper. Do you remember yeah. the story Casper? No. Yeah. So if you ever if you ever saw the cartoon. There was one cartoon that was Casper. I don't know why, but it, the story reminds me a lot of Casper. <laughs> so in Spanish, we call it Gasparin. So like Just Casper. Gasparin. Uh -huh, yes. so, yeah, that was Casper. Kind that was Gasper. super cool. Yeah, <laughs> it reminds me a lot. I don't know why. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much, Silvia, for sharing this story with us. Guys, I'm missing the last one. Uh, Carlos, would you like to share the story with us? Okay, teacher. Um, the answer is it's a, a comedy. Okay. Uh, this is um, once upon a time a beautiful and funny beer was filling around the window, mm -hmm. bridging a piece of paper with a beautiful color and the, that was motivated to paint. But suddenly, the computer turned off. Mm -hmm. I'm scared. Um. Score because these are a, a right song. That's it. Oh, okay, okay. I'm sorry. What was the last part? So, what happened at the end of your story? I have the last idea. Oh, but please. We have no time. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, yes. Okay. Uh, it made a strange sound and accidentally spilled all the paint everywhere. I messed up my jewelry and the yellow beard and up uh, with all the colors and my wig too. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. 
so you found a way to make it work. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Sounds really cool. Thank you guys. Very creative story, actually. Okay. Very nice. I really love your stories today, guys. And uh, definitely we got to. Um, this is like a, like not everybody you know have the same ability so i'm totally bad at this but we can give it a try definitely so guys i have a little homework assignment for you so for the, this is not like a homework assignment that you have to write or investigate not really so we are missing the trivia still so wait so we are going to try to tell a funny story but a real story, okay? So something that happened to you guys. This is going to be the homework assignment for tomorrow because probably you need some words, some vocabulary to try to tell us what happened to you. So do you have a funny story to tell? So, yes. ¿les ha pasado algo gracioso? Have you ever had like, I don't know, have you ever been into a funny event? No, probably. Well, my story is not for, about me, but it's about, about somebody my, else. No, about my grandfather. Oh, but if it is a still fun and we can laugh about it. <laughs> so for me, it was okay. funny. <laughs> so I'm going to tell you super quick. Uh, the last funny thing I remember, I was in Metro Sur. I was in the elevator and the elevator had the elevator had two doors have you ever been to the to the elevator that is near super selectos in the in the underground in, like in the first floor no yes yes sir. Uh, so i yes. went into the elevator and i thought the um, like the entrance was on the same side so suddenly the elevator ran and i was alone and i was like oh my god where is the rest of the people but I didn't realize that the door was behind me. So the door was not in front because in front there was nothing. So I was so embarrassed because I was there like, like crazy, you know, like stupid, looking at the door when there was nothing there. The door was actually behind. So that was more than funny. I would say that was really embarrassing for me. That was a long time ago. <laughs> but that happened, you know. So what about you guys? Think about the funniest thing that has happened to you. And you tell us about it yesterday. Remember, everything goes in past. So try to review verbs in past oh. as well. So you can tell us the story. Guys, this has been really nice listening to your stories. Unfortunately, time is over. And I'll be seeing you tomorrow. Guys, tenemos clases mañana, okay? Please don't miss. Va a estar bien mañana. interesante. Mañana. Yes. Mañana. Uh, we are tomorrow, having classes Friday. tomorrow. It's Friday. Eh, sí, les comentaba la vez anterior, I think, que vamos, íbamos a tener clases un viernes para eh, salir cabalitos con la Semana Santa y no alargarlo. So, mañana es el día, guys. Um, I hope you can make it. All right. Si por alguna razón you cannot do it, I will totally understand. But of course, si pueden acompañarlos, acompañarnos, that would be amazing. Y quiero escuchar sus historias. So I really want to listen to your stories. Uh, Thank no, you, guys. No, no, Have a good day there. Good I hope night, you can make it. Bye. I'll Bye. see you tomorrow. Bye. 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 Bye.